My name is Kate Sinkina. I am a teacher, English teacher at our school, local school. Uh, so can you see this great place? It's a forest, it's a pine forest, but there you can also see a mine. So we have a lot of environmental problems in our town. That's why I and my team, my students, great active students, we decided to solve, like to try to find out those environmental problems and find the ways how to solve them. So here are what we have. We live in a very polluted region of our country. Our relatives and friends suffer from different lung diseases. Even young people suffer from headaches and lung diseases. So we decided to explore the environmental situation of our, of our town um, and its sound readings to understand the depth of the problem and form the algorithm to improve the situation. When it all started? It started long time ago, for a few years she had STEAM lesson in English. We watched the video, we discussed them, we made a physical vocal course and got the electricity from lemons. But this time our teacher led the lesson with mosaic research and it was so interesting and exciting. We watched the video about global environment problems, air pollution, waste pro products, soil pollution, water pollution. We have seen three the models. After that, we worked with question sheet our teacher created on mosaic, and we decided to investigate the situation in our region. So first, we found polluted place, took some photos there. Later, each of us will show you the place and explain why we have. We chose this one. When we put some cotton sheets with Vaseline on it and we took them away after 44 hours, after that we examined some sample under a microscope for the number of contaminated particles. And here you can see photos we took them in microscope. So the results what were the most polluted was the sample which was taken near Central X. A chain factory second place took the one of we got near the mine number nine, and third place is for simple we got next to the slack heap. Also, with the help of secret spies, we got some photos of its old equipment, and her result why the territory near factory is so polluted. We think that's because of this old equipment which has not been updated for many years. We start learning about environment problems one year ago. During that period, uh, we had a lot of interesting lessons uh, about different types of pollution. We watched the video on Dr. Bynes' channel, uh, discussed uh, them, played cahoots and learned new words. Uh, here there are the topics of these lessons air pollution, water pollution, exit rain, plastic pollution, noise pollution, soil pollution, a waste, fossil fuel. We also cleaned forest and park in our town a few times because it's not a home to learn about problems, we have to solve them. As every year, we cleaned the forest, we removed a lot of garbage and collect a lot of lines, which were later given as a rough material. This is the Nadia mine, but we also call it the Nines. This is one of the most influential boulders of our city. This mine burns an average of 20 tons of coal per day. Uh, that are carefully masked by a living. Oh friends, 
I have found a very polluted place uh, in the pine forest near my city. Okay, let's show it. It's a very nice place, but it was polluted. Which is called the Snivka. This place was polluted by local people. Our team decided to clean this place. Uh, decided to clean this place. We, we also collected leaves from plastic bottles uh, to uh, say to raise money for people with health problems. Hi guys, my name is Sophia and I would like to talk about the biggest problem of our town. The stack heap has been pollution the town for, for about a year. The environmental disaster kills the land. Unfortunately, they can't do anything about it because mines are one of the main sources of income in Susnika. When we decide to explore the environment of upper area, the slab heap becomes the first place where we decide to check how polluted the air was there. The results you can see at the screen. Now we're in Fusan results, but we have what we have, and now we need to develop on algorithms for us and our design some uh, to improve the situation. And I hope that in a few years the situation will get better. I have taken photos of this lake because it was formed after the mine. Uh, uh, had uh, dug uh, this place. Before that, uh, there were people's wives and gardens. And now uh, there is the lake uh, which uh, gets deeper every year. During our project, we also made a questionnaire to get more information about health of local people. We asked them these questions. We interested 20 people. They, they were our friends, relatives or neighbors. Here are some videos from the interviews. Uh, yes, it uh, changed bad the walls because the uh, pollution is large and many people get sick from the pollution. Чи є серед твоїх рідних та знайомих люди, які часто хворіють на легеневі захворювання? Якщо так, то скільки? Де вони працюють? Так, мій тато. Він працював на шахті 13 років. Has the environmental situation changed in the last 10 years? If so, in which direction? Uh, yes, I think it's completely, completely changed uh, and in bad direction. Most people think that my pollutants are mines and slag heaps, and of course people. 40% of asked people have lung disease. Most of them work at mines or on or central enrichment factory. They don't know how much time does it take to improve the environmental situation. A lot of people thought that situation is worsened during last 10 years. And even young people feel the effect of polluted air on their health. They often have headache or lung disease. During the implementation of this project, we faced real environmental problems. Though about their solutions and our contribution to the protection of environment. Still, during the experiments, we got um, acquainted with the work of microscope, worked with real equipment, uh, and learned about different methods of its use. When we discussed the question, uh, how we can we prevent the situation from deteriorating? and uh, what we can dealing with at the moment. We made several conclusi conclusions. Nature is not only forest, deal fields, sky and fresh air. Nature is everything surrounds us. Nature is us. When people pollute the environment with factories, waste, household and other garbage, not only animals suffer from it, people suffer the most. We can fight pollution. We can switch uh, to eco packages in stores, reuse plastic or recycle it, reduce water and electricity consumption, stop using fossil fuels and start using alternative sources of energy. Factory managers must upgrade equipment to reduce environmental impact.